This is Randy Thompson coming to you live. We have Trudy Adams and Miss Melody. We're doing our warm-up walk. It's the end. It's August, towards the end of August, 2015. And this is Melody. Melody is how old is she? Eight? How? No, she's 14 now. More yet, yeah, Melody's like 14 years old now. And Trudy's been bringing her back. She's a Melody's what we call a hot, nervous, very complicated horse. Even though Trudy makes her look like she's not that way right now, it's because she's taken a good four years to get her to where she is now. When we first started bringing Melody back, is what I call it, we had to ride her in a double bridle just for safety reasons because she had so many mental issues and physical issues. But Trudy's kept up with her and what you're seeing today is a result of a lot of hard work and of course a little bit of love added in. You can see the history of, of Miss Melody and Trudy by going to the playlist area of this channel, Randy Thompson Live. And you can see their history for the past four years. And while you're there, remember to subscribe. Good, Trudy. Good. Now we're going to play with the steps to connection. You're just doing your warm-up walk. But when you touch her mouth, as you know, she should be softening her jaw. And she's bracing, and she's bracing a little bit. So if she's bracing, that's just an opportunity for you to be able to get her to soften to the connection. So it's taken us years to get Annie, to, uh, Melody, to finally start allowing us to have contact. She was okay as long as we went on a loose rein. Well, not really okay, but uh, she felt safer for whatever reason. And now we're asking her to stay connected between Trudy's leg and rein aids, which is a big change for Melody. In fact, this is, uh, again, like Trudy's other horse, this might be the a dozen times we've asked her to stay connected in a training session. And Trudy keeps working on it when we're not in the training sessions. But it's a big change for a horse to go from a loose rein, green horse kind of balance into having more of a connection with the rider. And that's the point that we're at now. Good, good. I like how you're keeping her active. All right, now start adding the leg you're feeling with your inside leg. So that she picks up your outside seat bone. We're going to start positioning her back end. So she's using her inside hind leg when Melody's hind leg is leaving the ground. So it'd be left leg and left rein would be now, 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 now. Good. And this is a technique as taught by the Spanish riding school. Good, 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 good. That's it. Keep her connected. Play. Ask her to give a little bit more to your outside rein. So first we're going to get her soft on the outside rein and leg. So she... So she doesn't stick her nose out and she gives to your hand. Add the leg yield feeling with your inside rein and leg. Push her over more so she picks up your outside seat bone. Good. Praise her. Yeah. And at first she's going to say that this is unfamiliar to her because it is new to her to be able to stay under your seat like this. Good. That's it. So when you're retraining a horse like you see Trudy doing here, the horses really don't know what we want. There's nothing we can punish them for. All we can do is do interspecies communication and show them that it's kind of nice to connect with us at this level. Good. Soften her outside rein more. More. A lot more. A lot more. She, yep, we ask her for the rainbow. The rainbows when they have a rainbow on their neck, which is a result of them picking up their back, which is a result of the horse stepping up from their hind legs into the connection of the rain. Oh, all that in one sentence. The beginning of self-carriage and coming through. Some people call this getting a horse on the aids, on the bit, in front of the aids, rounding up, packaging. Good, good. Take your time. That's right. So first she just has to realize that it's a safe place to be because... That's right. So what Trudy just said is that when she adds the leg at this time, Melody is trotting a little bit from her leg aid, which is normal. So it's okay if she trots. You just want to ask her to soften more with your rein as she trots. So you just get a little bit more. Ask her a little bit stronger with your rein just for that second. So she learns her release comes from releasing to your hand. And Trudy's not holding the rein long at all. Just long enough to where she can get Mel uh, melody to soften to the rain from the bit. As a result, Melody's pole gets looser and she'll lift up her back and create the rainbow in her neck. Good, good. That's it. That's it. See, you're getting just a little more demanding. She doesn't really mind. 
She's just now getting to the point where she's allowing you to position her differently. We're using the outside rein and leg to position Melody's nose where we want it to be. Good. That's it. Take your time. Good. I like how you're using the leg yield to get her against your outside rein and leg. Very good. So we've got headsets on today. I don't have to shout as much this way. Even though I still am doing it a little bit. That's all right. That's so she was saying, because we're relearning how to do this with the camcorder. So when she was going around, she was shouting and I had to say, okay, Trudy, you're shouting because we've got mics on now. So everything's a little bit different. And these are the mics I use for horse shows. So it's nice to use them for here. We'll see how the video quality turns up. Praise her. So you'll see it's a lot of praise. It's just a melodies. Oh, good. You like the feeling of using the circles to get her connected. Now, when you do that circle to get her against your outside rein and leg, you've got to supple her more with your outside rein. So she, there, until she gives you a mini stretch. So what uh, Trudy is doing is a leg yield feeling into a circle, a part of a circle, until she feels Melody pick up her outside seat bone, which is really when Melody's back end is in the right place. All right. Go ahead. Ask her to stay soft. So she's getting, again, we're in the warm-up, and we're going to go into a little bit of the trot now. This is Randy Thompson coming to you live. You can see more of the history of Trudy and our other featured riders by subscribing to this channel.